Naples is a golf mecca on the southwest coast of Florida. Beautiful beaches, natural wonders, luxurious accommodations, and quite possibly the best seafood in the world is all found right here. They call this Florida's Paradise Coast, and it certainly lives up to the name. During the next two episodes, we'll be unlocking some of our Paradise Coast favorites, including Tiburon Golf Club, where we'll compete on both the gold and black courses. We'll be experiencing the fabulous Ritz-Carlton Naples, kayaking down the Cocahatchee River, and dining at a Marco Island tradition, the Snook Inn. Buckle up because this is going to be quite the ride. Welcome to Let's Play Through. Welcome to Tiburon. Good to see you, Dave. Yeah. Glad to have you guys here. You're going to be my partner today. Yeah, um, good luck with that. Hopefully you've been swinging them well. <laughs> We just made it out here to the fabulous Tiburon in Naples. I'm here with Jim. Jim, tell us a little bit about what we're gonna expect out here today. So we're gonna play, uh, we call it, we're calling it the LPT Challenge. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna play uh, Scramble on the back nine gold, nine through 18, and then we'll move to the front side black course where we'll play a two man alternate shot. Should be uh, should be a challenge for everyone. <laughs> for sure, everyone it's a tight indeed. course, it's super tight. Very tight on the black course, gold's a little bit more forgiving, but uh, green complexes are very challenging. Tell us about the tournaments that you have here. What makes this place unique to me is that you've got not only a PGA Tour event, but you have an LPGA Tour event, and you have some other events that Correct. come through. Correct, so we have uh, coming up November 18th through the 24th, we've got the CME Group LPGA Tour Championship, followed three weeks later uh, by the QBE PGA Tour Shootout. Nice. A little bit more relaxed atmosphere for the PGA Tour. Sure. Uh, the race for the globe is, everything's on the line for, for that event. Is it $1.5 million check to the winners? Huge money, huge Whew. money. And then they've got the tournament trophy here that Jim is gonna let us maybe take out of the trophy case. Carefully, and hold. carefully. Very carefully. <laughs> but we're gonna actually play for that today. Yes. It's gonna be me and Jim, we're partners versus Patrick and Wade here behind us. Good luck, AKA Patrick and Wade. <laughs> AKA the winners, he Patrick's says. a scratch handicap. So and uh, we're gonna him. see who's gonna lift that cup at the end of the day. It's gonna be a pretty fabulous time out here awesome. in Naples. Yeah. Looking What's your... forward to it. Awesome, Jim. Thank you, sir. Play well, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let's see if Richard, our production assistant, can make contact here. He's never, never played in his life. No pressure. Yeah. <laughs> no idea what I'm doing. All right, that's one. That's one. All right. No. You hit. You made con. He made contact on that one. All right, you got this, Richard. This is all you, man. Steve down. Channel your Tiger Woods. Channel your channel your Tiger Woods. There it is. There wow. it is. <laughs> Bro, how does that feel? <laughs> How's it feel, man? Your first shot. Yeah, it feels cool. I, I, I never <laughs> did that. Wow. We are going to do a little scramble and a little mm -hmm. alternate shot. Here on the gold course, we're playing alternate shots. So how do you guys feel about that as a team? What, well, what, what's your tactics? So for me, I'm very confident, and I have one reason for that. It's, it's this guy. <laughs> so <laughs> he, he's, his confidence is probably really down, but mine's really up. Right. I'm not terribly confident. It's, see how tight this is? Like, yeah. Our first tee shot. And this is actually the this is actually the more open of the two courses, believe it or not. Wow. Correct, correct. <laughs> You've got all the local knowledge, so I don't want you to give these guys any tips. Oh. It's been many, many months since I've played this early. Okay. There we go. Since there you've been dew sweeping? Yeah, yeah, since dew sweeping, absolutely. And we're actually waiting for the mowers to clear out here. That's how early it is here in Naples. So beautiful yeah. day though. So what's your what's your day. strategy? Tell us your strategy. Uh, we're just gonna play good golf and put you guys down and embarrass you. That's <laughs> what would you say? I mean what else can we do? If we keep it in play off the tee, it's going to be a whitewash. That's, wow. That's oh, a whitewash. Yeah, oh, for a whitewash. Your team though, right? You don't yeah. even okay, know me. Right. Yep. Absolutely. Well, guys, I think they're clearing out. I think it's time to hit them. All right. And it's time to take you guys down. Good luck, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good luck, gents. All right, Good man. Luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. You'll need it. Uh -huh. Oh, buddy. We haven't even teed off yet. He's already going to the towel. That's how much pressure is on right now. Oh, come on now. It's the humidity. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, it's a good oh, shot. Hole number one, fairway found. Nella, we've got what, 114? 114. What? 
Go. Oh, nice bounce. All right. I'll take it. We're in good shape there. Yeah. I think we're on. I don't know. 97 yards to the pin. He's got me right here on the edge of the bunker. And, a you know, I'm a little bit above the hole. He'll be coming right down the chute. Good angle here. I feel, I feel pretty good about this one. My, my, my. <laughs> For the record, Patrick called that shot. It's going just that way. <laughs> Wade, you talk a lot. I do. He doesn't shut up. <laughs> hey, Jim, we need you, man. I'm sorry. Oh. Ooh. Okay. We are in trouble right now. <laughs> I like the choice of not using a wedge right here. That's, yeah. that's a smart play. Too many people take out a wedge and they chunk it, like he said, or top it or do something. I'm probably going left hand. Ooh, nice, cozy. We'll give it to him. Wow. All right, you, they're one up. They're one up. We'll give them that. My emotional state is uh, a state of euphoria. I would say it's very euphoric because we're winning. I mean, yeah. However, this is a nice, very tight, narrow drive, so. Heading to the 11th hole now, yeah. which is our hole number two. Okay. You're one up, how are you feeling? I feel like a Pepsi. Remember that commercial? <laughs> a Pepsi. No, I feel good, I'm ready. Wade doesn't know that he's about to incur a two stroke penalty right now because he's hitting off the wrong tees. We're gonna let him, we're gonna let him do Can it. Wait. Uh oh, up the daisy. Oh, it came out. Did it kick and, out? And I'm sorry, but I've actually got some bad news for you. That's a two-stroke penalty. Why? Kick back out. Um, because you're playing from the wrong tees, sir. Oh. I'm sorry, who approached the tees and set up the camera crew on the tees? It's not the camera crew, it's the player. It's on you, man. The player's responsibility, right? <laughs> Alright, we gotta go back That's to the That's dirty. Team. Big. Oh, I'm letting my partner down right now. Yeah. Not good. We're all the... Yoink City. That's Yoinkville, baby. How's that trash talk working for you, Gabe? I don't <laughs> think it's working too good right now. <laughs> Tell us what's going on with Wade today, man. He's got a little chip on his shoulder. What's going Whew. on? Wade, you know, he's gone through like three swing coaches and he's really intense right now. And he, yeah, he's not enjoying the banter. He's throwing it right back in my face. But they got really lucky. They're back in the fairway. We're, we got actually very lucky. We are kind of in the junk, but we've got a little lane to the hole and we're about 150 yards ahead of them. So I feel pretty good about our chances. Jim's got this shot in his bag, don't you, Jim? Uh, it's somewhere in there. <laughs> it's somewhere in there. We'll find out. Ah. Whoop. That wasn't very good. We're not exactly firing all cylinders here on uh, two, oh, two holes in. Where'd you guys end up? Well, you're gonna love the replay because you won't believe it, but this guy hit a bad shot and I'm actually over here in a bunker. <laughs> actually, I'm behind the bunker and possibly in the pond, so. Did you say your prayers last night or something? No. <laughs> something happened. Oh, go. 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 I think that's great. Oh. All right. All right. Now you flew it. Boy, I flew it. I muscled that through like a big boy. I'm gonna putt this thing. That's the only thing I can do is putt it. I don't know where this thing's gonna go. Come, could come right back at me. Here we go. This is where you just gotta say your prayers, close your eyes, and hope. Whoa! What, what a shot! What a shot! I'm on the green! <laughs> I gotta give you credit, that was excellent. That was the, the shot that dreams are made of. That's why you come and play golf. You don't come to play golf to hit good shots because anyone can hit a good shot. You come to play golf to hit the interesting shots. The shots that you wouldn't expect. That's what keeps you playing over and over and over. Keeps you coming back when you hit a shot like that.
Okay, I can make that. Now we can get it within three feet. Wow. That was pretty good, but Wade's gonna have a, a dicey little. All right, we're both laying four here. Wade's up first. We know Wade can't read a green to save his life yet. Luckily, he's got Patrick on his side. And I've got a putt I gotta hit probably just inside the left edge. They're coming downhill, we're going uphill, so I'm feeling pretty good. Whoa! Whoa. I don't think you can give him that, Tim. Mm. Hey! Good, good, good. Let's good, move good, on. <laughs> yeah, good, good. I like that. All right. Oh man, I had him. I let him off the hook. Jim, how nice is it to just come to work here every day, man? Uh, trust me, I've, I've, been, I've been doing this a long time. Uh, and so I've been here 14 months and I've absolutely, uh, I can't wait to get up in the morning to come to this facility with great team leaders and operators and- uh, It's a great our, staff all around. Our, we call them our men and women in blue, our warriors of hospitality, and they do it best every single day. They have a passion for service and uh, they deliver it every single day. And that's why it makes me proud to come to work here at Tiburon. I think Wade lucked down here with Patrick hitting this shot. I don't think Wade wanted to be hitting this one. Uh oh, uh oh. That's very unpatrick like. Ooh, what a Ooh. oh, he's in the pit. Oh, the pit. Give me a sandy. You can't that give me a sandy. Too. You, could, you could be in there all day. Oh, yeah. That thing is deep, yeah, man. Yeah, man. That's, a, that's like a desert. I need a canteen. Okay, my partner's up to bat here. The door is open. That dog's gonna hunt. Get up there, get up, get up. Yeah! Jim, great shot, man. Thank you, sir. I think we're back. I think we are back. We're down one, we're on our third hole here. But they're in the pit. I don't, I've, I don't yeah, know if you've watched the show, Wade's bunker play is, leaves a little bit to be desired. And he's up against the wall. He's gonna have some trouble here. Is he right up against the wall? Very oh, close. Right. There's some beautiful bunkers here in Tiburon, Naples. Some yes. of the nicest bunkers I've ever played in Florida. You just don't get this look very much. What are they called? They're called, it's, it's done by Echo Bunker. Um, and they're Dura, Dura bunkers, um, low maintenance. Yeah, they're beautiful, is all I can say. Oh, look at Wade. They've got the little layers like you're in Ireland or Scotland. Correct. And just really, really pretty. Check these things out. And that's Wade right up against the wall. And this is going to be one heck of a shot. I think I'm ready to do a side bet here. It's side bet time. Patrick, you want a, you want a little side action? Are you ready? Well, what is it? One in. I think he's going to leave this right back in the bunker. I don't think he's going to get it out. Oh, no. Oh, I'm not dear. taking that. You're not taking he's that? He's definitely getting this out. So take the bet then. All right, I'll take it. I'm going to bet you a cold one. What are you, What's your drink of choice? You can get me, I was going to say a Foster's, but that's a bit cheesy. To... Foster's. Here we go. Let's see if he can do it. That is one delicious Foster's coming my way, Mr. Patrick. That's your teammate for you. And guess what? Guess, guess what's worse is you get to go in the bunker now. <laughs> All right, so this is where I'm taking my own advice and uh, I'm pulling out the uh, Texas wedge. Taking my own advice, Jim. Uh-oh. Ooh, that was hairy. That was hairy. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what we do. If you're going to win, you win in style. We're back in action. We're back in the game. Well, it's just even. Don't get too excited, guys. Here we go. Here's your camera. I like you're doing business. <laughs> Look at this guy. 13th hole. It's probably one of the prettiest holes that I've seen in a long time. Beautiful purple and gold here. And, of course, green. And we are all square. Partner, right there. 
good shot. Hold on. He's gonna be okay. Good shot. Yeah, we got a putt. We're putting. Keep putting. <laughs> my wife taught me that. She's Latina. She taught me that. I didn't have rhythm before I met my wife. Hole 13, right? Thank you, Neil. <laughs> right in his back swing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yes, it's hole 13, Neil. <laughs> You can't make this stuff up. No. I timed that way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> it's great timing, Neil. Are you ready for a little redemption? Want to go double or nothing on that beer bet? Closest to the pin? I I don't trust myself with a lock wedge. Ooh. But why not? All right, come on. Double or nothing. Try to save your teammates. Left a little bit to be desired. That's a beer. I'll take the beer. It's in! Oh! <laughs> Ooh. Oh. All know. right, we are one up. One up. One up. Technically, you could blame that hole on Big Sexy for talking to oh, your hey, backswing. What? <laughs> <laughs> you did. You did get the money, right? Yeah, got the twenty. I, make, I want to make sure you're getting covered. Yeah, I got you back. <laughs> Love you, Wade. <laughs> We're on hole 14. Little dog leg right bunker, running across the right side. We're up one, feeling pretty good. So my partner is about to show you the way. Okay. Very good. Oh, that's a peach. Oh, that's murdered. Yeah, that was a great shot, Jim. Whoa! Great ball. Wow. wow. That's got to be that's got to be three bills right there. How does that feel, buddy? After my terrible last shot, I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, I'd say you got to be happy about that. That was that was Shake smushed. Up. Smushed is the word. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Fortunately, it was 201. Right. Snorkeling club. In the club. wrong direction. Did you get that? Yeah. Oh, buddy. Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> oh, man. I don't think you can repeat that. It's like a brotherhood we got going on here, Gabe. That's amazing. I, I left him wide open. The door was open after I hit my ball in the water, and that was tops, Bill. We've got 260. What club is that for you, Pat? Five iron. I'm going to go for it. It's downwind. Three wood. Three wood. Hope for the best. Wow. With all those bunkers. That's brave. Considering it's my bunker oh. shot. Yeah, thought, exactly. On second thoughts, <laughs> if I'm going to put it in a bunker, I'll just play it short, I think. <laughs> yeah, oh, we know buddy. your partner might not be the best out of the bunkers right now. Open for the best. So, what distance would you like him to get you to? The green. I would like him to be on the putting <laughs> service, and I would like you guys to not be on the putting service. Oh my god, That's this guy I'm cracks hoping. me up. I'm hoping Jim gets me to 80 yards. That's what I told him. Jim, get me to 80. I'll be feeling really good about that shot. Oh no. Wow, that was not good. What happens when you're in the pro shop too much? Oh, oh, oh money. money. That's going to catch that bunker, isn't it? Mm. Nope. Oh, oh, that's perfect. Great shot. Look at that. That was awesome. What a brilliant shot. Thank you. Sir. How'd that feel, buddy? I felt brilliant. Oh, it should. <laughs> Great shot. I you. Look, they're running. They're not feeling happy. <laughs> you want to go double nothing for a Foster's man? Yeah. <laughs> so you're saying that you're actually going to get your shot I'm going to get mine inside of, inside my next of shot. yours. Yeah. Inside of my next shot. Inside of your next shot. Absolutely. All right. You're going to for a foster. All right. 
while we're at it, I will teach you some Australian. If you want to learn Australian, since we're talking to uh, Fosters. Give it to me, man. All right, guys. So here's the deal. Just say these three words. Rise up lights. Rise up lights. Razor blades in Australian. Done. Rise up lights. Rise ah! up lights. That's, <laughs> That's good, true. huh? Rise up lights. Rise up lights. Wow. That's all I got. <laughs> I'm a one-trick pony. That's more than I know. <laughs> ah, I didn't stay down on it. Oh, oh. no. Go. Oh. Oh, yes. So that's inside my next shot. For the wager. Hi. For the, look at me. For the wager, that was going to be inside my next shot. I never said where the hole was. The hole was the sand trap. That's That's ridiculous. <laughs> that's not even funny. <laughs> whip, 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 whip. Whip, whip, whip. I think we need to go straight at it. I don't think it's going to move much. Here. Take the head cover off, Wade. That is not how to hit a pitch shot. <laughs> I'll let you off the hook, partner. Oh, look at you! Oh! Good putt, Pat. Good putt, man. The muley grass out here is this beautiful purple that you see all over the course. We're really lucky because this only happens for three weeks out of the year. So we're here at the perfect time at Tiburon. Oh yeah, Good nice. Every blind squirrel finds an acorn. That is it, <laughs> that is mine for the day. <laughs> oh, that's nice. nice. Partner. Nice Boom. Work. Very nice. Good job for yourself, no, man. Thank you. Hey Wade, sorry about that. We didn't mean to outdrive you again. <laughs> that found that didn't sound solid, but it looks okay. It's really good. Good looking shot. Very good looking shot. Oh yes! That's my partner. That is the partner. We came to play. I'm so confident in my next putt that we're gonna go cup cam. Are you ready for cup cam? Yeah. <laughs> cup cam. Uh-oh. Turn. Great putt. Oh! <laughs> so we're here on 16 on the gold course, and this is an absolutely gorgeous hole. Over water, four bunkers surrounding the hole. Right now, Pat just made an incredible putt on 15 to keep the match square. The downhiller, it was a snake that he made. And uh, Jim, my partner, is about to tee off. I think I'm going to get to see what one of these beautiful bunkers at Tiburon looks like. Good boy. Oh, too much. Ah, oh, that's all right. Too much. That was terrible. <laughs> no. I don't think he's too happy about that one. He has the eye of the tiger though. You can tell he's in the zone. The golf perv is in the zone. Yeah. Come on. One time for mama. Not moving at all. Sit. Is that good? Wow. Put the pressure on him. I'm going to be a gentleman right now and give you that putt, Wade. Oh, six inches? You want to give me mine? No, I'm not giving you yours. Can you believe they're not giving me just the insult of this? The insult? Yes! How dare you insult me like that? 
We're on 17, which is our eighth hole, all square, a lot of action on this hole. 559 par five, little dog leg left, slightly uphill approach. You got the beautiful Ritz Carlton in the background. And it's just gorgeous out here. Yeah. The pressure is building. Yeah, there's some good drama going on here. I like it. And I'm hot. And, uh, and I have no doubt we will come out victorious. Wow. Oh, wow. Jim, that was beautiful. I heard a little grass. I heard a little grass behind that ball. I think Jim might down drove him. All right, so we got to make a decision here, Jim. Uh, I think we got 217 to clear the bunker. I'm not swinging it great. They've already laid up. I think you follow suit. You think? Lay up. Oh. Wow. It's a smart shot. We're, we're, we're here to win. I didn't come here to be smart. All right, but I did come to win. Oh. <laughs> I did come to win. I know you, that, you teed that up way too easy. <laughs> what are you hitting? A uh, five iron? Yeah, that's good enough. Perfect contact. Well done. Ooh, that was high. I'll probably what I'll end up doing is just doing the old uh, skull it and uh, put it over into those palm trees. The old <laughs> skull -a -roo. Get up. Boom! <laughs> Didn't you hear that someone putted it in? Maybe you should take some advice. No, I said do or die. Great shot, but not bad, not much. bad, not bad. Stop. Cozy, Perfect. baby, cozy. A cozy little kitty. Great job. That's my cozy little kitty. Yeah, nice line. work. We're one up. It's do or die. Let's make them pay. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. No, no. <laughs> wow, that was beautiful. I can't wait to see the shot trace. This guy's out there just skimming stones. <laughs> yeah. He thought this was like the skipping cup. <gasps> <laughs> oh, beauty. Yeah. Beauty. We're in trouble, Gabe. We are searching for Jim and Aloisi's bull. And this is an out of bounds stake. They said they weren't looking for it. All okay. right, Gabe, we got to give us a proper knee drop. Yes, proper knee drop here. We're on the bounds. We'll be hitting four from this area. No, we're not good. <laughs> oh, oh boy. Are you serious? What a shot. Of course it got up there. Shot. No. In the nice. Uh oh. All right, so we're on the 18th green. We've got about 12 feet for a five. Gabe They're... had a ridiculous shot. <laughs> ridiculous shot under the pressure. If Wade can knock this off the green. Yeah, that's off the green. And that is. Bye bye. Bye bye baby. Bye bye baby. It's not bad, but still there's room. So if we make this, I think we still have a chance. Jim, my partner, again, out here studying the greens since 5 a.m. Talking to the greens keepers, getting all the, uh, getting all the tips from the, the mowers and the rollers. Feeling good. Nope, it's not turning. It went the other way. Wow. Patrick, if he's smart, just make gets it cozy. 
They win this hole, we move on to the back nine. Good putt. Boom. Nice putt. Square. <laughs> All square. The trophy is on the line and the pressure is building. Well, that wraps up the gold back nine, which was our front nine. Check us back here next episode of Let's Play Through, where we're going to go to the black course and see if we can crown a champion. We're moving to a scramble format on the black course, and we're going to play the front nine to give you something a little bit different. We're going into Sydney's pub here at the clubhouse. They've got some cool beers on tap, and they've got some delicious Florida favorites. Ah, we are hungry, Chef. Hello. Oh, you're the man of the All hour. Right. What are we looking at? This is a uh, fresh Florida black grouper sandwich grilled with our house cut fries. This is wow. a uh, lemon caper remoulade and a grilled, yeah. grilled lemon for you guys. Look at that thing. Yeah. I like that you grilled oh. the grouper. We buy the best grouper you can buy. I buy them the, the size of a whole cutting board. Really? Cutting out, yeah. yeah. Wow. That's the best that, way that to go. portion is no slouch. Yeah. yeah. How often is your fish coming in every day? Every three days. Every three days. Mm -hmm. Wow. This That's came, this came in yesterday. So. Nice. It should it be perfect. beautiful. Moist. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to That's, take a bite It's out. nice and thick, too. All right. So. What else oh, we got? This is a Tiburon burger. It's a Ooh, uh, eight, ounce, eight ounce ground chuck and short rib. We got wow. uh, fresh fried onion straws, two white cheddar. It's got the white queso on top, lettuce, tomato. Nice. And again, with more of our seasoned French fries. You gotta open the mouth wide. Yeah, that yeah, it's, it's, that a, is, it's a big mouth burger. That is unbelievable. We need jaw exercises for this thing. <laughs> this is our uh, raised short rib cheese fry. So you can just set that in front of where I'll be sitting. No problem. Uh, that's it's close amazing. enough, I think. Yeah. Is it? Is it, in, is it in, did you put it in beer, like to braise it? It's because beer and Pinot Noir. Yeah, you can smell it. Beer, Pinot Noir, it. and it's got a, a, a beer queso on top of it. Wow. Uh, four different cheeses and it's guys and then you see the, the short ribs on top. It's like four hour braise. It looks like it, you could fall right off the boat. Yeah. That's zero calorie, right? No, yeah, right. Zero calories. These are, our, these are our new famous, they're the Tiburon hand breaded buttermilk tenders. Oh, Chicken tenders, yeah. breaded in buttermilk, brined in buttermilk overnight. Again with our house seasoned fries. Smells good. Is our, a little spice to them, a little kick. A little, little kick, a little yeah. seasoning. I smell that too. Yeah, this is, a, this is another one of our famous, or our most popular dishes. It's a, uh, Look at the plating on It's that. a tuna tataki. It's a seared uh, raw tuna. It's on a, um, a bed of sweet chili aioli with a um, lemongrass uh, cabbage slaw yeah. and a little bit of spice if you want a little Beautiful spice dish. it up. Beautiful dish. Perfect Look sear and a great presentation. Yeah. Thank you. Pan down the back. One more. Wow. Wow. This is our Italian deli pizza, uh, flatbread. It's a it's a really nice crispy crust. It's got capicola, ham, salami, oh, wow. red sauce, fresh locally grown micro basil, micro basil uh, duet of tomatoes that are also grown right up in Benina, which is only an, like 45 minutes from here, awesome. and Kalamata olives. So it should have lots of really good mozzarella. Italian flavors. Nice fresh mozzarella. Fresh mozzarella and regular mozzarella and come Asiago. Out of bag. So yeah. what, what's Kalamata. your what's your culinary style like how would you describe the way you cook or the way you present I like it very simple very clean not not a too much over I don't like a ton of like things that don't belong on the plate sure. if it's on the plate it needs to, it should go with it right. uh, I don't like to, you know some people like to put flowers and stuff it's not really that's not really my style my style is fresh I want it to be like everything's gonna have a nice flavor right. um, really good quality um, Whatever I can get, I want it to be the best quality. Chef, so what's your favorite dish on the menu? Well, on the table right now, I would say the grouper sandwich by far, because I know you know how fresh it is, how the quality of it is, and I know you know we have the perfect seasoning on it, grilled. Whether you get it grilled, blackened, or fried, it's always going to be perfect. So wow. I'm ready to yeah. dive in. Awesome. I mean, my mouth's yeah. watering right now. Good. I don't know what you're going to go for first. The fried chicken looks really good. The uh, burger. I'll be, I'll be on the short rib <laughs> short fries. fries. Yeah. Man, well done, Jeff. Well, you guys so enjoy, yep. hey, and uh, thanks Thank for coming so much. out. Absolutely. Nice to meet you. Thank you. I don't know about you, but I'm salivating. Are you oh ready? my gosh. Let's dig I mean, in. I, I, don't, I can't talk because the water is flowing out of my mouth. Yeah, this <laughs> excites me a lot. <laughs> let's, let's dig into this thing. This is the short rib cheese fries. Look at the cheese coming off of there. Oh man. <laughs> That's really good. It's that hearty. was a gluttonous bite that I just took. <laughs> it's hard. And I am very excited about it. It's a great warm weather mm. food. It's October here. Starting to get a little cooler in Naples. Well, I don't break, care break, about break, the weather. This is perfect any time of year. <laughs> That's good. Let's try something else. Let's try this chicken. Okay. Chicken it is. All right, I'm gonna take, um, take that baby That's right cute there. that you're using a fork, but I am gonna go <laughs> commando on it. Commando. It looks nice and moist. 
And you can smell a little little kick to it. Yeah, it is. That is... That's mm, good. That's really good. You don't even need a dipping sauce. It's just no. melt in your mouth, perfect. There is a secret sauce here, though. It's everything that you want all in one. Mm. Oh, yeah. Takes it up a notch, even. That's like Chick-fil-A on steroids. <laughs> like, yeah, it's like the Chick-fil-A yeah. sauce, yeah. Yeah. That's right. It's good. All right, it's really let's try good. one more thing here. You love you some tuna, don't you? I love seared tuna, and this looks really good. Got a little aioli sauce on there. Mm-hmm. Mm. Nice little soy. Yeah. Very well balanced. A little sriracha on the plate, it looks like. I'll try the slaw. Let me get in there. Mmm. It's really nice. It's a winner. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's great. That's a great, that's a great little appetizer. Cool. Do you want to try the grouper sandwich? Well, I think we should. Let's, let's pass this down to the boys. You guys can dig in now. Grouper sandwich. So we, we have this grouper this sandwich. I don't know where to begin. Okay, where do we start? I'm gonna cut off just a little. I feel like that's the best play. Is slice cutting slice. off a little corner. Cut off a really meaty there corner. There you go. Now is that a, a corner for you or both or what? How are we gonna do that's that? My corner. You get your okay. own corner. Okay. I'll do that. Look at that. Cooked perfectly. Mm. There's nothing like being on the west coast of Florida and having grouper. That's that's the ultimate. If you haven't done it before. Sydney's Pub might just be the place you want to do it. Well, that's going to wrap things up for part one from Naples, Florida and Tiburon Golf Club. But there is more coming at you in the next episode where we take on the black course to settle it once and for all and see who's going to lift that trophy. Make sure to come back and see what happens when Wade and a dolphin collide. Oh, holy shiitake. And we're going to visit the Snook Inn and taste some of the greatest seafood on the entire Gulf of Mexico. All that and more on next episode here on Let's Play Through. Make sure to hit subscribe, make sure to like this video and comment and let us know where you'd like to see us take you next. We'll catch you back on another edition of Let's Play Through.